What is up guys, we are back with some more Nexomon Extinction and when I came out of the the headquarters we got hit with Bonnie trying to talk to us so instead of me clicking through it to go explore like I typically want to do after I get done recording, here I am, sadly. <laughs> so Blades, Blades, a silver tamer and so soon people are starting to talk about you. Edward asked me to hand you this as a congratulatory gift. Vitality core too. Okay, so now we can put more health on our Nexomon. Horse can be equipped to your Nexomon. They may boost stats or provide other advantages. The Vitality core too that I just gave, you can upgrade the maximum health of a Nexomon. Try it. Huh. We should check the team menu later on. <laughs> Cores are mostly synthesized in labs. Are you curious? If you have some spare time, visit my lab on the western side of the city. See you. Could have said see ya. Before we leave for the Drake Isles, it'd be nice to check out Bonnie's place. Those core things seem useful. All right, I guess we'll go check out, because I did want to go there to see about um, making some more EXP uh, cores. Let's see. The airship hangar is over there. That's how we get to the Drake Isles. Don't forget about Bonnie's research lab. We can synthesize cores to power up our Nexomon. It's up to you though. What should we do? See, cause I wanted to, I wanted to go do some more side quests to see about getting more uh, EXP boosters and stuff, just to make it way easier for us to power through everything. And actually I totally remember now like that I'm a silver tamer, there's some houses I should be able to go into now. What did this person ask for? Okay, yeah, that's right. They wanted five of each of those. I probably should have waited till after. But I got those whistles, so those those whistles come in handy if you guys are wondering really how important the whistles are. Because they stack. So right here, Nexo Traps are 3% more likely to capture fire types. This one, like all of them added 3% like increase. And I have three for water, so that's a 9% increase on it. See, again, everybody has these whistles that you can trade shards for. Thank you for the shards, I appreciate it. So that's also how you get your reputation up, I think, is from completing all that stuff. Oh, hello there. Have you come to synthesize cores? Let me help you out. Yeah. See, we got some defense stat ones, some more HP boosting. See, this is what, this is what we need. So I need, wow, I need everything. Wow, to me, like, I feel like like just like uh, maybe a few hours of farming for these uh, in like the caves and stuff. Like I, I, could, I should be able to get all that. But yeah, looks like we have all this. Oh, wow, I even have, I could make these, huh? How many of these could I make though? I can only make one, right? I could either do one that does 8%, and then one that does 16 just to get us to 24% instead of making one 25%. I don't know, but 25% seems good. So I'm going to, I'm going to just make that and put it on probably who doesn't have something. I'll probably put it on Camilibo. Just, I, for some reason, feel like I'd be leaving Camilibo and like behind or something. Hideka, you got your good stuff. I don't know. I'm like, what do, what do I give you? Like, <laughs> but alrighty, we checked out that core, made an extra uh, EXP copy core, which I think is pretty convenient. Now we're gonna just head over to the Drake Isles. I think. Yeah, they said go to the, was this the hangar? No, that's experimental weapon hangar.
this has to be it, right? I find it funny that we like we go indoors like upward, but then like it shows us going through coming out of the west entrance. Oh, dragon whistle. Okay. Sweet. Oh, oh, snap. Stand back, you bunch of thugs. It's the third time we've had to kick you out from that building. Amelie wants a word with you, Brad. You are so full of dirt, you're hiding something messed up. Hey, come back. Oh, he's back in the airship. Would you mind looking for and apprehending that boy? He'd be doing us a great service. Where was he trying to break into? An abandoned facility in the Drake Isles. It may be discontinued, but there's still valuable technology in there. He is incredibly obsessed with the building. Please bring him to us. I guess we can look for him inside the airship. Many thanks, Blaze. Don't let that brat fool you. He's up to no good. Why me though? Like, you guys, you guys don't want to just go in there? Hello, sir. The airship is ready to depart. Are you heading to the Drake Isles today? Shall we get going? All right, then. Please follow me. I also bought a ticket earlier um, in the game that I think I needed in order to even get on here. Other than our Tamer rank, I think they said like they typically only let silver ranked uh, Tamers here. This music's nice. I like it. Wow, this place is nice. I heard that a lot of Tamers visit the Drake Isles to capture lesser dragons. Oh right, that strange kid must be hiding somewhere in here. Let's look around while the airship is en route. All right, someone just had coins in the trash. Is that how rich you guys are? Those who become grandmasters are entitled to a personal airship. Why? Yeah, that's a why. Why do you get like your own? Like these things are just for one person. If you need to deposit or withdraw next, I'm on use this console here. I do not. I like how it saves when you go to like inside buildings or exit buildings, go to new areas. Ah, we found him. Okay. You, you've come to take me back, haven't you? What's your obsession with that old place? You cannot fool me. The guild did something to upset the dragons. The place was abandoned because the dragons kept targeting it. Yeah, well, dragons are dumb. Who cares? They're not dumb. Dragons act with purpose. You folks were doing something terrible in that place and nobody believes me. Whatever you're hiding, I will show the world. Okay, are you wearing a dragon skull though? Like Something that angered the dragons, huh? You seem like reasonable folk. At least let me show you the place. We can't do that. We have a job to do. Here, let me give you this. 50 coins, bro. That's nothing. Are, are you trying to bribe us? We'll show, <laughs> we're silver tamers. This is not going to work. How about this? Dude, stop wasting your money and stop taking his money, please. <laughs> How about this? Just keep it coming. Coco's so fed up. Coco's like, bruh, what are you doing? Fine, you can show us the building. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. I'm Leo, by the way. As soon as we reach the Drake house, I'll guide you. You won't regret this. I already do. You're supposed to guide us, but you already left, dude. Oh, hey. We can leave the airship by exiting down there. That's cool. Let me see what's in here first. Though. 20 coins. A Sandillo companion. Okay, yep. You guys already know the drill. New companion equals we put it on. Sandillo. Dragons are very picky about the food they eat. The village and drink I'll probably sells what you need though. Probably. I haven't even checked out a store yet to see what I can buy as a silver uh, badge holder. Oh. Okay. 
We got a chef over there. I like the feng shui going on out here. <laughs> the Drake eyes. Okay, now we got this open so we can catch dragons here. And the dragon's like, it's not like a specific like type. It's really just like the creature itself is a dragon and it belongs to like any of the element. Wow, so this is the Drake Isles. I heard about a village that specializes in catching dragons. We could learn a thing or two from them. We sure could. What is this? Oh no, we're not heading back. Um, we're not gonna go on the grass because we might run into something and that's just gonna slow us down. I just wanna talk to the chef and see what the chef is. The one patch I walk to has something. But look at the level. Look at like the how like the levels jump, guys. Like you see why like now I say like I grind off screen. It's, right. it's level twenty one. Come on. <laughs> A good tamer always carries all sorts of meals to learn next to my meal. I got some that you're missing. Let's trade. Oh, that's it. Yeah, I'll pay 250 coins for all that. Different places and merchants will offer their own kinds of meals. So wherever you go, make sure you're stocked up. And then there was a merchant here. Greetings, tamer of the guild. The best supplies are available in Lydia's village, but this should do for now. Hmm. I don't see anything really different. Uh, well, other than the fact that I can buy super potions, but I'm not gonna buy from there. Let me heal up. <laughs> All right, there's uh, our guy Leo. The village is all the way to the north. The laboratory happens to be right in the middle. If we're lucky, Euros won't be guarding the entrance. Euros, that's Lydia's tyrant, right? Yep, the tyrant of wind is super strong. Come on, hurry up. Really? Excuse me, traveler. Isn't this place a little beyond your skill level? Many naive tamers come here thinking that they can handle our dragons. Would you care to prove me wrong? I would care to prove you wrong. Okay. You're a, you're a dragon? Um, was it that, was it rock that was, that was weak against wind, by the way? I can't remember. I think, it, I think it was rock that was weak, though. So, pulse storm. Yeah, pulse storm is our fastest move on, uh, Camilo. We're good, though. Got that heal coming in clutch. Why does it do so much? Okay. I totally forget about like the level difference too in here matters. Wow, you did not need to do that much damage. <laughs> These enemies are interesting. I think Ghost, I think I said, was good against the wind. Yep. Of course you bring out a uh, freaking heretic. Yep, there we go, got the leech. Okay, that was like a pretty nice switch out I did. 
until you decided to crit. Something like that? That is, Bullet Seed's my fastest move, sadly. And we miss. Don't crit, don't crit. Ooh. Oh, you did get it, but it just wasn't for 30 something. I can't remember if wind was super effective against Okay, no, it's just it's just regularly regular effective. <laughs> All these, all these switches I'm doing. <laughs> that did more than I expected it to do. But he is right, they are pretty strong here. Look like these level early 20s out here putting in work. 33, wow. I'm about to run back and heal up. Twin, twin electrode. Okay, that's gonna be good to have because I'm kind of tired of of using pulse storm. I, I don't even use absolute barrier. We're gonna get rid of absolute barrier. It might come in handy later, but for now, I, I'm I'm not sure. Oh, now that is a welcome surprise. You're a decent tamer, Blaze. I shouldn't have judged you so harshly. Do be careful. Regardless, our drakes are not so easily tamed. Okay, well, I'm still going back to heal up because you did really just put in work on my team for no reason. Oh, there was a healing thing there. <laughs> Hello, friends, and welcome to the Drake Isles. Also, you're being followed. You've got a keen eye, but it won't matter against us. Is this like those weird dudes that we beat up earlier? We are the Sword of the King of Monsters. We are the legacy of the ancient Nexo Lord. I am the Warrior of Fauna, Lord of the Fire. Okay. I'm the warrior of Arqua, mistress of the sea. I'm the warrior of Luxa, king of the thunder. I'm the warrior of Ventra, lady of the tempest. I'm the warrior of Grenda, juggernaut of the earth. Okay, so... And together we are... Power Rangers! <laughs> the Nexo Lords! The, the what? The Nexo Lords, come on, we practiced all night! Honorless cultists who glorify a dead monster called Omnicron. D don't you dare utter his name. One day, the true king of monsters will return and end what he started. But first, we've come for the tyrant egg of yours, Blades. She's like, you have a tyrant egg. T tyrant egg? Blades has a tyrant egg? Yeah, that was our little secret. Ho ho, looks like Blades has been keeping a secret or two. Fear not, if you give us the egg, we won't tell anyone. Oh, you have one of the, uh, one of the ancient, um, Nexomon. These ones are, like, extinct. Was Wind good against, uh, and you're level 25. Like, what the heck, what the heck is this? I should have definitely grinded up. Okay, you're just gonna <laughs> keep switching out into grass types, right? I swear, I can't get these statuses to, to proc as often as they're able to get them to proc on me. Oh, that looks pretty nice. Yep, the strongest, strongest electric move.
doing lots of damage. I'm like, I might as well just use Hedeka out here. Hedeka out here is like the only one caught up in levels to, to really fight Greebull. Oh, huh. Your three did a crit. Oh, we failed. I totally forget that there's a chance that this thing can fail. See? I'm trying to proc leech. Can we proc it? No, we can't proc it. But we survived that. Mm. We're putting Sickabob out. twice that's fine with me do i have to fight all you guys like back to back because that's going to be annoying wow okay well i guess i'll just redo that battle and pick it back up i don't know why the game just crashed like that but guys leave a like for this video even though it has an unfortunate end and subscribe to my channel, help to the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.